Okay, so I was working with one of our users who was trying to embed his presenter course within his WordPress blog. And after spending a little bit of time with that, I found this plugin. Actually makes it really easy. It's called Embed iFrame. I got it off of WordPress.org. And what this does is it gives a little reference line that will create a iframe within your post so you can embed the entire presentation in there. So once you download it, you want to activate the plugin. All you need to do is copy this line of code right here. This really more of like a reference line and go back over to your post and paste that in. So the three values that you want to change are, are the URL, so just add a link to your file. You want to point to the player.html file. So I have a, a directory called test slash and then here's where I put the three folders, right? The three files, the data folder, the player folder, and the player.html. I want to point to the player.html and then for width the width for my blog here is 500 width, which means this is going to be 337. Now I know how to get the height because I know that presenter, when it, you take the whole player, not just the uh, slide area, but the entire presentation with the menu and the player, that's 980 by 640. So with that, I want to scale this down proportionately based on whatever the width is of my, of my uh, blog post. Click preview, and it should just appear. So check that out. There it is. And you have your menu over here. You have your thumbnails. Everything is visible. You might want to go slide only view if you're doing this, but all your interactivity is built in. So a great way to showcase your latest e-learning projects by embedding your uh, courses in your blog. Again, it's called WordPress uh, at wordpress.org. I embed iframe. It's a simple plugin. Just reference that one line of code and point to your player file.